What's going on guys? Babs here, coming to you from Olympic Tee Shot number 10. Um, this is the one that I think a lot of people have problems with because they need to find a way to get around these trees. Um, for the most part, uh, the initial idea is to hit a punch right through the trees, which is one option. You do run the risk of maybe hitting a branch, but that is one way to get through the trees. Another option is to go over the trees. And this can be done with both a three wood or a driver. Um, particularly the three wood will get over just because it has a lot more loft. I just can't seem to get this top tracer out of the screen. But if you're playing from the back tees, it is possible to get over the trees with the driver. And I, my driver has a parallel on right now, but I'm just going to hit it half, half power to show you that even with a half power driver, you can still get over those trees. And next thing you know, you have a decent shot into the hole with a sandwich. Another option, especially for a left to right wind, is if you aim to the left out here, and then you miss ding really late on the meter, you can hit what is basically a slice. And that'll get you around the tree. And of course I have a parallel on, so it's gonna go explode into the rough. But the idea is that you're drawing the ball around the tree so that you don't even come anywhere near hitting that actual tree. So it's just a matter of getting your timing down and you hit a slice right around the tree and then you have a simple little sand wedge into the hole. So hope this helps. Hope this takes some of the anxiety out of trying to get around the tree on hole number 10 at Olympic. And I will catch you out on the course. Take care.